guys, this is Janice, Pink and Silver Lady here. Today I'm gonna do two Ipsy Glam bags unbagging. I have my March 2021 and my April 2021. So if you'd like to see what I received in these bags, just keep watching. I wonder why do I have two bags well my mail system is horrendous this is the third time they have lost my glam bag packages say since August of just last year so I had to get a hold of Ipsy so they reissued it go figure man and it, it, it bums me out because I want to do these in timely manner and it, I just forget it you know <laughs> so I just don't want to get them and I try not to stress about too much it doesn't do any good I'm going to go ahead and do my April first for those who maybe aren't interested in seeing the mark because you've seen so many I don't know but uh, I'm going to do April first this is the bag for April it's really cute it's a kind of a canvasy bag it looks like some orange lips and maybe, I don't know, some type of, gosh, almost looks like underwater seaweed or tropical type thing. And the little pull zipper thing is lips. Really cute. And they gave us a card. And, okay, the uh, theme is Force of Nature. That's probably why they have nature type plants on there. Whether you love your naked face or feel naked without your red lipstick, do what you feel is natural to you. Okay, and then it tells you, oh, it does have the products I have on here and uh, the description of them. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. This is a $12 a month bag. It is the smaller uh, subscription, beauty subscription for Ipsy. And Ipsy is a monthly beauty subscription. They have three different tiers. They have this one, which is $12 a month. They have a middle one, which is the Glam Bag Plus, and you get five full-size products. That is $25. And then they also had a Glam Bag X, comes every three months, and that is $55. Now, I get this one, and then I get the Glam Bag X. The Glam Bag X is more higher end products generally. Well, we only had one so far. It was really great. And this next one, we've seen sneak peeks. It looks really good too. And I think that comes with eight products. And that comes every three months. I think I said that already. Okay. All right. Let's unzip this little baby. See if there's anything in the bag. Yeah. Sometimes something doesn't fit in the small bag there, the cosmetic bag. They put it in the bigger bag. Oh, by the way, in case you don't know it, you always get a cosmetic bag with this subscription. Well, this is really cute. It's a brush. It's really cool. Let's see. It's the Bow Jangles Concealer Perfecting Brush. Oh, I don't have any like this. Of all the brushes I have, I don't have one quite like this. Oh, it's so soft. All right. Hmm. All right. So this is definitely a full size, and it retails for seventeen dollars. So already, I've got my money's worth out of it. Okay. I'll go ahead and pull out something else here. This is by Nomad. Nomad Cosmetics, that is, and it is collaboration with Sydney Bather's Kiss of Sun. Oh, wait, is it collab? I'm not sure. It says Nomad Cosmetics Nomad and Sydney Bathers Kiss of Sun Highlighter and Bella Morrow Beach. So this is a highlighter. Not sure if it's a collab or not. Hmm. Don't know. It's a highlighter. So Nomad, I like their um, eyeshadows real well. I'm trying to think if I ever had a 
trying to think if I ever got a highlighter from them. I may have, I just don't remember. But um, so far, what I've received from them, I enjoy. And uh, here's me trying to open this up. Why didn't I grab my knife? I don't know. Got it. I got it. It's not your time to open these. If I'm not careful, I rip this. I don't like doing that, especially if I want to give it away. Because it's not that I don't think this is a nice product. I just have so many highlighters. That baby is in there tight. Oh my goodness. Here is the color. I'm not going to swatch it. And this highlighter is from Nomad. Nomad, I said that. And it's finely milled pigments with maximum blendability and infused with native to Australia Mer Mercandra oil to soften and moisturize your skin. And this is a deluxe sample size. And the full size product is $27, but this is deluxe sample. So that is the highlighter. Let's see what else we have in here. This is a mascara. It's by The Balm Cosmetics the mad lash travel size mascara the difference between nice lashes and amazing lashes volume boosting formula right here unique molded wand grabs into every lash and lifts it to new heights plus rich black color it's super pigmented and lasts all day without flaking and this is a deluxe sample and the full size is $18 I like getting mascara. Uh, I enjoy mascara. Okay, and this here is by New Honey it's Boost Up Honey Rich Moisturizer. So that's nice, nice tube. I like tube moisturizers in this size, so when I travel or not that I travel, but <laughs> if I ever did, um, or just, you know, I'm gonna pop in my purse for some reason. It's easy to it's easy to be compact if you know what I mean. And it's got a safety seal there, so I'm not gonna open it up. It's moisturizer. It's a cream. Okay, hey honey. Boost it up honey rich moisturizer. Get ready to glow with this luminous cream pumps, brightens, and moisturizes to give dull, dry looking skin a dewy, luminous look. Plus, it's infused with honey to minimize redness and inflammation. And this is a deluxe size sample. Full size product is $51. Yeah, I'm having issues with my eyesight lately. Really bad. Everything's blurry. New, I got new glasses. It didn't do any good. I don't know. For those who don't know it, I have um, macular degeneration. So, I get eye shots every couple weeks. And, yeah, so we're trying to fight that disease with that. The last thing in my bag is something from Koki. It's the Koki Cosmetics Crystal Fusion Liquid Eyeshadow in Polaris. This gorgeous rose gold shadow is infused with fluorescent pink flecks to give your lids a warm glow. Even though it's a liquid, this shadow will not slide or crease. A few seconds after you apply it, the formula does dry down to long wearing high shine cream. And this is a full size. Oh wow. And suggested retail price is eight dollars. That is a drugstore product for those who didn't know that Koki was. I think most of you probably do. But this is a drugstore product, and drugstores have some wonderful products. I'm really excited about getting this. I love the color rose gold. My favorite colors. It's a doe foot. Go ahead and give it a little swatcheroo here. There you go. Really pretty. 
go ahead and spread it out a little bit more. My shirt look really nice on my lids. I thought that is a swatch of it. And that is what I got in my April Ipsy Glam Bag 2021. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and do my March bag. And before I get going, just want to remind each and every one of you, if you haven't already, to please subscribe. That'd really be great. I would love it. Join my family here. And also, like this video. This really helps me a lot. And comment. Do you get Ipsy? If so, um, just tell me a little bit about it. If you like, if not, that's okay. Just say hi. It really makes my day when you guys say hi to me and talk about things. I appreciate it. Get to know you. And also hit that notification bell so you will be notified when my next video is up. And also you can share this video. That would be really helpful. We're going to go down with my March bag. Now, they did re um, reissue my March bag. And however, the bag they gave me is not the March bag. I don't know, I forget which month this was, but this is the bag they gave me. I really was disappointed about that. It's not their fault. They obviously ran out of bags, but the mail system lost my bag. But that one was... I, I wanted the bag because it was Women's Month, March was, and um, it had four different women and different diversities. And I really wanted that bag. I, I'm a, I just love the bag. So I got an extra one of these, but that's okay. I'll find someone who will love it. I like smelling plastic. <laughs> it's cute, but I already have it. All right, let's see. I don't get a card with this one either, so. We're just gonna pull it out and I'm just gonna show you what I got. Best I can do right now. I got a blush by Eco Fabulous. I never heard of this brand. But uh, it looks nice. It's a little tin. It's really cute packaging. And it looks like it's a pink. Let's see the color here. Carmilla. Clean beauty, it's clean beauty and recyclable packages. I think it pops, oh, this pops out. Huh. Cool. I guess you can reuse that tin. Next thing I'm pulling out is something from Hanel. It's a low alloy. It's a tube. What is this here? Um, man, I'm having a hard time seeing. <sighs> Boy, this eye problem I have is getting on my nerves. It's Hawaiian Face Cleanser. Oh, okay. Face cleanser. I'm actually getting low on face cleanser. So, this is nice. Let's see if there's a safety seal here. Yeah. So, I'm going to open it. Just wanted to smell it. I like smelling things. I'm, not, I'm pretty sure that blush is probably a full size. That one I just pulled out. The cream is definitely a deluxe sample. And we got an, an eyeliner called 1999. Haven't heard that brand either. And it I like this because it's a... Usually you get black all the time, but this is like a pearlescent um, nude color. And I do wear this color a lot in my waterline, just to make my eyes brighter. So that is really cool. Let's see here. It's nice and crisp. Or it's a highlighter pencil too. I don't know. Pretty sure it's an eyeliner, but you could use it for whatever you want. Yeah. Oops. Wrong end, Janice. <laughs> oh my goodness. And this one here is I Woke Up Like This by Sophia and Marble. It's Skin Perfecting Primer. Oh, it's a primer. I always enjoy getting primers. Yeah. 
no safety so our either that or I tried it already and took it off I don't remember it's a clear primer I think I did try it on my hand when I opened the bag and it feels nice no smell all right so far I'm enjoying so far what I got and I get did get what I chose I did get to choose an item and I chose the benefit extra length magnetic mascara they're real they're real magnetic okay and guess what I have this on today I knew I was getting that because I chose it and I was getting really impatient I wanted to try it wanted to try it so what I did yeah I went to Ulta and bought, my, bought myself one thought oh well I can use two so I've already used it and I really like it I have it on today you can see it's a drier formula it does make them nice and long and not messy at all. I, I like it. It's a nice clean look. Look at the little horseshoe. Isn't that cute? And the brush is nice. I like this one because it's easy to get to my lower lashes without making a mess. So I'm enjoying this mascara. Alright, that's what I received in my Ipsy Glam Bag for March 2021 and I have some more videos to um, make I have quite a few in the works that I want to do it's just finding time now that I'm working I work four days a week and the days that I work it's all day long so I'm gonna get home exhausted and if I were younger, I probably would have the energy to go ahead and hop on here and do some more videos. But man, I just can't drive myself to do it. So I, I cram these all in in the weekend. Filming, that is. Which is not a good habit to be in. But I really need to make some money. Um, who doesn't these days? So this is how it is. But I will still try my very best to keep getting content up for you. And I do have different things to do for you. I really do. It's just getting them up. I keep saying that. You guys are not going to believe me. I keep saying it. I'm not following through. I mean, I have brought, bought products to review and have tried them and loved a few. And uh, yeah, I just still haven't filmed them. Well, I'm going to keep, I'm going to quit jabbering on here and go ahead and let you go and sign off but again I, I appreciate you listening and watching and I will see you in my next video bye